Hello and welcome to Astro Yoga on this new moon. As you arrive, I invite you to get comfortable and settled. We'll begin with the guided relaxation practice here. And this new moon is a special new moon because it is the new year in the astrological calendar. This is the, the beginning of the beginning. And the, the zodiac tells a story in many ways. And Aries being the first one begins with the I, with the me. And you are invited to have unapologetic focus on yourself, unapologetic honoring of your own needs. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe to support this channel. Wholeheartedly in love with yourself, choosing yourself so that your hopes and your dreams will choose you in return. That's the invitation as you get into the comfortable state of Nidra to supercharge your inner world, to cultivate the things that you need to prosper and thrive. So I invite you to get your most comfortable position and then allow the eyes to close if it's safe and comfortable to do so where you are so that the ears remain open and the ears will listen, they will pick up everything, all of the sounds, these instructions, this voice among them, but you're also tuning in to listen to the sounds all around you, in the room or in the house, in the building where you are. Maybe you can hear some of the sounds outside and beyond, listening for the sounds of the world, And coming inward as well to listen to the sounds of your body, the sounds of your heartbeat, your pulse, maybe some more subtle digestive sounds. And listening for the whisper of the breath, listening to the sound of the breath. Letting the ears just hang out with these sounds. There's nothing to do, nothing to change, nothing to react to or to respond to. Just holding this awareness, this sense of I am among the sounds. I am a witness, an observer. And in the same way, turning that awareness inward, listening to the the inner voices and see if you can find that loving voice, that caring voice, the voice that speaks with the empathy that you might offer others and let that voice speak to you. As you remember for yourself and repeat in your own mind, what are some of your dreams? What are some of your hopes? What are you inviting? What are you calling in? What are these desires? Trusting that desires are something we are hardwired with. And it would be a cruel trick if they were not meant to be fulfilled. And so trusting that whatever your heart desires is meant to come to you, is meant to be delivered. What would that be like to plant those seeds, those seeds of your dreams and the seeds of your hopes? Repeating in your mind, in your inner space, just a few, a few soft and kind words to yourself. And letting them go, letting them go. as we move to a rotation of awareness, beginning today with an awareness of the mouth. Notice the bottom lip and the upper lip. And dive in to notice the inside of the mouth with the inside of the cheeks, right and left, the roof of the mouth, 
and the bed of the mouth where the tongue is resting. And taking a moment to feel the lower teeth and the upper teeth. As you extend this awareness across the whole jaw and into the cheeks now, right cheek and left cheek with their cheekbones. Awareness moves to the temples, right and left, and the eyes, left and right. Right eyelid, left eyelid, left eyebrow and right eyebrow. Noticing the bridge of the nose and the point between the eyebrows, eyebrow center. And onto the forehead, hairline, crown of the head and back of the head, right side of the head with the right ear and the left side of the head with the left ear. The neck and throat. Be aware of the shoulders and down the arms to the elbows and down to the wrists. Notice the right hand and the left hand and let the awareness touch the right hand thumb, index finger, middle finger, fourth finger and little finger and the left hand thumb index finger, middle finger, fourth finger, and little finger. Feel the palms of the hands on both sides as they connect up through the arms into the armpits and into the heart at the center of the chest. Notice the ribs all around the heart space and around the lungs down to the abdomen, the valley of the waist on the right and the left, and the awareness of the low back, the pelvis, the right hip and the left hip, down to the left knee and the right knee, down to the right ankle and the left ankle, the two heels, the soles of the feet, the right foot, big toe, second toe, third, fourth, and fifth. And the left, big toe, second toe, third, fourth, and fifth. Be aware. Be aware of your feet and ankles, the lower legs and the knees, thighs and hips, the whole pelvis, low back and abdomen, the chest and the upper back, both arms, neck and head together, the whole body, the whole body, the whole body. Be aware of the whole body here, resting, breathing, the whole body in this awareness, the whole body. Be aware of the body and the breath. Watching the breath. Watch every inhale and every exhale. Taking these few moments to be with the breath. And just witnessing, an observer, watcher. And taking a moment to become curious about where there might be doubt in this body asking the question or inquiring within, what does doubt feel like in this body? Perhaps 
you have a clear experience of doubt and can feel it. And perhaps it's not a state that you're in very often and it might be something to remember, to recall. And in this practice, just inviting the sense of doubt. What does doubt feel like? Where is it in the body? Taking a moment to acknowledge doubt. And as you let that go, turn the awareness to the opposite. Where is the confidence and what does that feel like? What would eliminating self-doubt feel like? Where does confidence live in this body? That righteous sense of I can do this, I can have this, I can be this. What does confidence feel like as a physical sensation? What would it be like to have no concern for limitation, to have no doubt? Trying that on, inviting these feelings of confidence. Acknowledging both the doubt and the confidence and noticing how they play in this body, in this life, how they feel as physical felt senses, doubt and confidence at the same time. This new moon in Aries invites us to revamp our self-esteem and to move boldly forward, eliminating self-doubt. So cultivating that confidence, that self-assuredness, supercharging that fresh sense of, I can do this. in this state of Nidra awareness. And this might be your practice. This might be what you came to receive. And as you build that confidence with your breath, with your inner knowing, your inner wisdom, exhaling all that is unlike confidence, exhaling the doubt, releasing the insecurity. You might choose to stay right here in this state of awareness. And you can always return. You might come back to this state of confidence at any moment. Thanks for joining this session. Notice how you feel in your whole body now. And take a moment to be aware of all the benefits. Remember, you are always welcome to come back. If you haven't yet, please subscribe to the channel. Maybe hit the notification button to get the latest videos and like all the videos that you watch. If you enjoy these practices, consider making a donation. There's a PayPal link in the description and other methods on my website at olgashwa.com sponsor. While you're on my website, please add your email to my list to get the updates of my new YouTube uploads and live Zoom classes and special workshops. All the things that don't even make it to the channel. It'd be great to see you. All gratitude. I'm Olga Schwa.